Do you know how to count from 0 to 10 in Brazilian Portuguese? Do you know what the word meia means when it comes to numbers? If you answered no to at least one of these questions, don't go anywhere and watch this video till the end. Oi gente! Hello everyone! My name is Maite and I'm here to teach you all about Brazilian Portuguese. In this video, I am going to talk about cardinal numbers or números cardinais, números cardinais in Portuguese and teach you how to count from zero to ten. Cardinal numbers, números cardinais, tell us how many of something. They show quantity. For example, one, two, three, etc. Ordinal numbers tell us the order of how things are set. They show the position or the rank of something. And we will have another video dedicated to ordinal numbers or números ordinais in Portuguese. From 0 to 10, we have 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And these are the forms that we use when counting in mathematics, phone numbers, etc. Or before a masculine word. However, before a feminine noun, the forms for the numbers 1 and 2 are uma and duas. For example, uma cadeira, one chair. But um lapis, one pencil, because pencil is a masculine word in Portuguese. Or duas casas, because casa is a feminine word in Brazilian Portuguese, but dois carros, because carro is a masculine word in Brazilian Portuguese. The bonus tip here is something that Brazilians do all the time and can be quite confusing. When quoting phone numbers or other series of numbers, the word meia, meia is normally used instead of seis, six, to avoid confusion with três, three. Meia is short for meia dúzia, which means half a dozen. If you are talking about flight 467, for example, one might say Vou 467. 467. Well, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, share it with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe. Like this video and leave a comment below. I love hearing from you guys. See you on the next video. Vejo vocês no próximo vídeo. Tchau!